Wow. Hey, boomers. Um, I didn't think that I would be making this video. And uh, not in the YouTuber apology way, but uh, we actually hit 100 subscribers, which might seem like a small milestone, but uh, it means a lot to this guy over here. And uh, because of that, we got we got some questions. Uh, this is a live, not a live Q&A. So sorry about that. Uh, Jinkies. This is a Q&A video, not live. But let's answer some questions. Um, so our first one comes from fellow YouTube content creator and a uh, personal friend of, of ours on the Slipknot Boom channel. Uh, it comes from Damn Dan. Where he says, uh, where are the movie reviews? Um, that is a great question. Um, the movie reviews have not seen any action on this channel. But um, if you follow my Instagram account under the same name, I don't remember if it has the little tilde, not a tilde, the little underline thing between it. Like I know this channel does. But we just put, just put it slip down, boom. It's, uh, you'll find some ravishing delightful movie reviews with uh, great insight but um to answer the question as to it being on this channel um i don't know where the movie reviews are we'll see if i make them and if i do that's that'll be a good thing but um yeah i keep put put a pin in that one damn dan um we'll we'll we'll, we'll see about that uh great question next one comes from Another personal friend, but um, has not been on the channel, which uh, hopefully is subject to change. Uh, Escalators. He says, why are you so handsome? Oh, thank you. Uh, also, where, where are the cars collectibles reviews? Oh, uh, okay. All these questions are going to be about where the reviews. Okay. To answer the first question, um, uh, good genes, I guess. Uh, you know, I, I work out. Uh, eat your green vegetables. Um, my skin has cleared up a lot recently and I'm trying this new hairstyle and, uh, oh yeah, I, I guess technically this is a, a face reveal too, so you wouldn't know what it looks like before, but, um, yeah, this, this is what we're working with right now. Um, as far as the Cars Collectibles reviews, um, I, I just haven't seen any that have really striked my interest. You know, I, I, uh, I love Cars as a franchise, as, as a concept. Um, but yeah, I, uh, I will get some cars eventually and do, uh, reviews on them as they were because they are collectibles. That's why it's called a cars collectible review. Um, so I, I could say more honestly than the movie reviews, uh, you will see at least some cars collectibles coming. Uh, next one comes from Jay Barosco. He says, hi. Big fan of both the channel and Instagram account. Oh, thank you, Jacob. Uh, where is all the content? Um, well, this is uh, another question. Um, the the content hopefully will be arriving soon. Um, at the time of me filming this, this is my first day off of off of work. Not 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 to say that I have worked for six straight months without a day off, but um. Uh, I, I just uh, left my summer job uh, on good terms, on good terms. But um, uh, yeah, so I, I should have a little bit more free time now. Um, I will be starting up my next job in about uh, like 10 days or something like that. But uh, let's not worry about that. Let's just enjoy the time we have now, which is uh, why you're getting this video right now. Hopefully in this time, I can somewhat uh, get proficient at, at doing some sort of editing so I can make some content that I'd actually like to make and be proud of. Not to say that I'm not proud of this, but I am really just talking into a camera and I appreciate you for watching it and for at least a hundred of you for finding it enjoyable. But I think, I think uh, there can be better. So we'll see. Um, another one comes from another YouTube content uh, creator. Um, hopefully to be on the channel one day. Uh, Skinny Luigi, uh, did the chicken come before the egg or did the egg come before the chicken? Uh, wow, coming at us with the uh, the, the big heavy hitting questions I see. Uh, no more playtime. Um, I believe that the chicken came before the egg. 
because why are we only asking it about the chicken? Couldn't we literally ask it about any creature that comes from an egg or anything? Um, so just, just, just so we can stop giving the chicken a hard time, I'm going to say that the chicken came first. Um, and that is a, a fact, Jack. Um, oh, uh, okay. Jacob Orozco came in again. Uh, a chatty one, this, this guy. He says, uh, what editing software do you use? <laughs> um, Jacob Orozco, if you're referring to the Pokemon franchise, uh, videos in which, uh, there were editing things happening, um, gotta give that up to my, to my, my, my boy, my home skillet, uh, friend of the channel, Dan Dan. Um, I believe he, uh, he, he, uh, edits with something called, uh, Da Vinci. Um, it's called Da Vinci. Uh, that's what he edits on. Um, hopefully, uh, I can somewhat, uh, learn how to use it. But basically what I just said a minute ago, slap that right into there. But, um, I, I did do one edit in a Cars Collectibles video, uh, personally, uh, and I did that on iMovie. So, uh, there answers that question. Um, next one, next question we have comes from, uh, Phoebe Chin. Um, and it says, wow, with about, uh, six, six O's in between the two W's, um, which Phoebe Chin is a W, a walking W. Um, thank you. That, that isn't a question, but, uh, it, it makes me feel good. So, uh, this could also be a reference to, uh, the Pokemon Smash Your Pass video where I go, wow, um, a few times. And uh, yeah, oh, another one comes from Damn Dan. Um, yeah, he 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 uh, he is a, a regular on this channel, as you can see. Uh, also been cooking up something with him too, uh, pretty recently. So that you should see a little bit more of Damn Dan uh, very recently in the future. He says, uh, "Why are you like this?" Uh, I don't know what this is referring to. Um, uh, I'm Peak. Uh, so I think that answers that question. Uh, and our last question comes from a good, good friend of mine, uh, started in a damn Dan video, um, as Squidward Tentacles. It's our man, Gabriel Neal, uh, hopefully soon to start his own channel. I already got the YouTube account ready. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, he says, uh, are you single? Uh, okay. This is. I'll answer this one first. He has two questions. Are you single? Uh, yes, I am. I, I am sing single. Um, so anybody that, uh, 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 I'm, I am searching. So anybody that, you know, uh, wants to hear some more of these Slipknot Boom reviews, um, in the next stage of life, um, give me, uh, give me a shout out. I, I'm, I'm in the comments regularly and uh hit, hit up the uh the instagram account with the same same name so not boom um uh send me a dm and uh this is a good question what is the best slash your favorite sonic game now this is a great distinction that i'm really glad gabriel neal has has made the best and your favorite are two completely different things you gotta like it one objectively and one as what it is your favorite and uh, if I were to say the best Sonic game, I would probably say Sonic Mania. Um, it is uh, really good. It's, pro it's probably the best Sonic game. But uh, it's not my favorite. It's definitely up there. It's top three. If I were to spitball my top five favorite sonic games real fast um i would probably say sonic rush sonic generations sonic mania mm, sonic three and knuckles and my i i it's really hard to say a personal favorite sonic game but i might just do that i always flip flop between sonic three and knuckles i got it right here I got it right here, um, signed by not the completionist, not Gerard the completionist, but his friend, 
Um, but I would say, in, uh, in fairness of this game being kind of overlooked and also kind of uh, slapped on by um, people in the Sonic community and just gaming in general, I'm going to have to say that my favorite Sonic game um, for right now is uh, Sonic CD. Sonic CD is a great game. The level design might be like a little weird at times and it might not be the most like memorable Sonic game as far as stages go, which I think um, in all reality is what makes a Sonic game a Sonic game is how memorable the zones are. But um, in exchange for that, you get a really cool idea with going to the past, present and future. And uh, it is also just straight up my favorite game to 100%. I think that's truly the only way to experience Sonic CD is if you go for the 100% route. It just makes the game so much more lively and just honestly just a lot better and more fulfilling as a game. And I would have to say that that's why Sonic CD is my favorite Sonic game, which is a lot for me to say also shout out to sonic adventure for just being a, a also a really good game um it it's barely it's it's knocking on the door of being in the top five that that game's pretty goaded um as my, my good buddy escalators can uh, can tell you go check out his uh con his content on this channel um he posted some 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 clips of the his sonic adventure stream um it's it's just a good game i think it's a really good game and uh, that's left for all of the questions. I've answered them all. And uh, I just, again, uh, genuinely, I want to say thank you for 100 subscribers. Um, it's, it's the first milestone. It's not a milestone I thought we would achieve. Um, but it, it makes me feel good. And hopefully we can make some more content, make some, make some better content because you guys deserve the best and just thank you for sticking out there. And uh, this is Slipknot Boom, the man who can review anything. Just wanna say thanks. Have a good day.